Hi there, everybody. It's Ashling Mooney here. You're very welcome, Coach on Call. Um, my name is Ashling Mooney. I'm a spiritual business mentor and coach, and I have light workers who want to create a, a spiritual business that's successful, that's fulfilling, that's sustainable, and profitable. And I'm live for the whole of this week, Coach on Call. So it means that I'm going to answer some of the questions that I've been getting. Over, over years now, the last few years, every time I do a new promotion or even just any time I'm on, I'm on live or I'm active online, people send message me about their business and, and it, I, I can't always um, answer the questions. I don't always have the time. So I'm making a big block of time this week to reconnect with everybody. As some of you uh, will know that I've been traveling i've been moving with my family we've completely relocated from ireland to italy so it's been a transition of quite a few months so i'm really only settling down now uh you know getting back to business getting back to my work with light workers so uh, just wants to reconnect so i thought a really good way to do that would be to just spend the week answering your questions on anything anything to do with spiritual business anything to do with growing your list, your tribe, um, bringing in more clients, bringing in consistent income, reaching people all over the world, how to make money from your healing gifts, how to run a business and have a family, I, a young family of two children. I moved here, my two children, my husband. Uh, so anything about business, the practical stuff and the energetic stuff, the mindset and the foundations, all of the, everything that it takes to run a successful business. So any questions, uh, all access this week. So I will be live every single day at one o'clock. And then I'll probably drop on impromptu during the week at different times whenever I have a minute and I'll just pick a question at random and just talk it through. My aim is to get as many questions answered as absolutely possible this week so that I have a full bank um a resource pile of questions where you know videos and audios where and pdfs and where i can send clients and i can send new people that have questions um for me so i really hope this is useful to you and i look forward to answering your questions so i have a brilliant uh, question today and it's from lorraine and she messaged me this last month so i'm just getting to it today so and she's just joined hi lorraine Hi, Narina. So, Lorraine, if you want to type in your question, maybe just how it's relevant to you right now, I can answer it directly. We can have a, a conversation. I wonder if we can even come on live on the. Hi, Sonia. So, anyway, the gist of Lorraine's question is that she absolutely loves her one-to-one -one work. She loves her holistic practice. If you do a um, massage, Lorraine, or healing or what exactly is it that you do but Lorraine loves working one-to-one -one with people and she's not really um, right now it, she just loves one-to-one -to -one work and she is looking at a way to increase the size of her business expand her reach without losing that um, that piece of her business that she absolutely loves so it's a brilliant question um, so hi everybody hi Olivier um, so Lorraine, if you have that question there, if you can maybe phrase that in a way, or even just say yes, if that's more or less the gist of it, and I will start to answer that because I have a little few notes on that. So for any of you that are out there and you're hearing all this hype, hype, get online, get online, you know, get your spiritual gifts. I, mean, I use that. I have the Bone and Heart program, which is specifically to help people to create the first package and whether that's online or in person and to get it out there in the in the with the, the web page and all of the usual um so i mean i i teach that as well but the first thing i want to say is for you if you are happy in your spiritual business if you're doing one-to-one -one work and you love it and you have consistent clients and you have consistent income if it ain't broke don't fix it keep going that's fine. If, if you're making consistent income and everything is fine and hunky-dory, then just keep going the way you're going. However, I'm going to add in a few little tips and tricks 
and things that might be useful for you and might be might give you food for thought as well this is for you Lorraine but it's also for anybody out there that has a spiritual business right now and that might be doing okay you have you have some clients you have some money coming in and um, and you truly love that work so first of all there are systems online tools and systems that you can use um, to help you to reach more people and to help you to have get some of your time back that you might be wasting in uh, your business at the moment so for example for every client that comes along you probably have some sort of to and and fro of them trying to book and uh, you going back and forward with uh, you know can I book yes you can book here's the PayPal link and um, book the PayPal link <laughs> okay when are you when do you want to come for an appointment I'm free these days you're free these days I'm not free uh, you know so the first of all I would say to you is always get advanced payment for any any treatment package program that you offer always get paid in advance or offer, offer people a payment plan but get money down first do not put an appointment in your book unless there's money in the bank. That is my advice to you, whether that's the part payment, the deposit, or the full payment. Do not put appointments in your diary. Do not mark it in your diary unless um, there's money in the bank. So that's, uh, that's just one tip because people will, uh, it's an opportunity then for people to cancel, it's an opportunity for people not to show up. Whereas if, we, if money's in the bank, it sort of gives um, you're invested, so you're going to show. You're going to show up, and honestly, people start to get results the minute they invest. I've seen that in my own life, and I've seen it with my clients. That literally, the minute they invest or put a deposit or something down, they start to get results. So, you need your PayPal Me button, which is very easy to set up. If you have a PayPal business account, you can get that button set up, and you can literally, as soon as somebody messages you in whatever way they do in your business to book an appointment, you can send them your PayPal me button, get your payment in advance. That's the system that ensures that you get paid, ensures that your clients shows up 99% of the time. And um, so your PayPal me button, uh, or you could create a sales page. So a sales page is one web page, which brings people on a journey um, through the learning about you, learning about the product or the service that you're offering and then invites them to uh, click a link to book, click a link to pay, or click a link to enroll into a program. So that's a system that you can use. A system that I absolutely love, it costs $50 a year. I think that's what it costs me. Excuse, please forgive me if that's not the right price, but it's very, very cheap. Um, and there's lots of them out there, but I use timetrade.com and it literally, it has saved me so much time with my clients of back and forth I'd like to book when can I book when does it suit you when does it suit me oh I have to cancel I have to reschedule this is just a dream all you do is you go in you have your calendar you set up the times that you're available I'm only available for clients two days a week that's the only time I generally it's a Tuesday and Thursday sometimes it's a Tuesday and Wednesday or something like that but I am only available two days a week and I will only see clients on, on, on those two days unless they're a VIP client and it's an emergency if they need some help and they need some coaching right away but generally I have two days a week and that's when I coach and I do one-to-one -one work the rest of the time is working on my business on the promotion on the the admin taxes accounts um, web pages, doing these live streams, reaching out to my audience, ev marketing, everything else that goes in the background of the business. But the beauty of these uh, online calendars is uh, that you can create your space in your calendar, you create your times so that you can see clients. Like I've only about eight spaces a week that I can physically talk to clients. Energetically, that's all that I can um, that that I can help in a week, one to one. I can help many more in groups. So you decide what you're energetically available for. You put that into your diary. And all you need to do is send the link. People can book themselves. They can reschedule themselves. Now, I know that's going to bring up, but Ashling, uh, people might not be available on those two days that, uh, that you have free. So I'm telling you that. 
when you become uh, okay the more confident you are in your work and in your marketing and the way you present yourself and your expertise out into your to your audience into your market the more respect and the more confidence that people will have in you so it's if so how would you feel if I was available 24 7 and you could just pick up which I was <laughs> I used to be I used to be take it back a few years and I would literally see a client any day of the week I was doing evening classes which I hated I was doing retreats at the weekend I was available to suit my clients so that all changed in the last few years and now clients book when I'm available um, so there's a whole there's, a, there's actually a whole piece that I'm going it's a, it's a mindset piece and it's a confidence piece that I'm going to go into in a, a deeper into another question but for right now a calendar is one of the most time-saving things that you can use to clients booked into your diary and it also creates a, a sense of professionalism as well that when somebody books with you they pay in advance you have your system you know you can take people through that yeah great you're interested this is how I enroll clients or this is how you can book with me uh, here's the PayPal link here's the PayPal me link it's whatever price it is um, uh, book when you've booked get back to me and I'll send you my diary link it's as simple as that and then you, you choose a time that's available for you it's as simple as that it works like a dream and I know that my clients that have started to use it absolutely love these systems so hi everybody that's joined me Teresa hi Teresa I haven't seen you in ages hi Veronica hi Anne hi Grania hi Sana hi Bernie so any questions you have post them and I'm gonna I'm gonna answer them live I'm here for about 30 minutes so if you have questions if what is your biggest challenge right now in your spiritual business I'm not finished with you Lorraine I'm gonna come back but I'm just giving people an opportunity that I'm here for 30 minutes every day at one o'clock or longer um, I have probably 45 minutes that I can squeeze in every day this week and then I will pop in impromptu during the during the day the rest of the day but if you have any questions right now what's your biggest challenge in your spiritual business right now what do you really really need help with and if I don't get to it today I'll get to it during the week you know what what are you stuck with is it getting clients is it bringing in more money is it consistent income what is it that you're most struggling with post it in, in the chat in the uh, comment section and I'll answer so Lorraine said uh, she basically does energy work and one-to-one -one work with her clients she does color therapy holistic massage energy healing I want to expand but I'm not sure how to do that online okay so Lorraine since she's heard everything that I said and she's taken that on board but she really wants to know about the online piece so this is something that a thought across my mind as we as I was thinking about your question Brian and I was thinking at the moment you're seeing people one-to-one -one. what if you get sick or somebody in your family gets sick and you're not available for work then you're no longer available for that income to come in to you into that channel everybody I'm sure understands what I mean that if your business depends on you and one-to-one -one and you're having a bad hair day or you're sick or your kids are sick and you can't turn up for work as an entrepreneur usually if you don't work you don't get paid so the idea of online is to create some sort of passive it's called passive but I don't I don't really believe in passive 100% passive income there's uh, packages and programs that you can create that will help you to um, to have some product or service that doesn't depend on you physically being there that can bring in consistent income uh, every day all day depending on how well the system works for you so you can do that by creating your first online uh, product or service um, and that could be around a program now what is most likely is that you're saying the same things over and over and over again to clients so when a client comes to you maybe they book one session maybe they book three sessions or whatever you'll notice over time that you, you you're saying the same things over and over again drink water 
and do this meditation and make sure you eat really well make sure you stay grounded get some affirmations uh, so you would start to say the same things over and over again so wouldn't it be nice if you had some package or program that could support your one-to-one -one work so if somebody was coming for color healing and they came and they had one session they absolutely loved it and uh, let's just take the scenario that they said look i really want to work with you but i can't afford this continue with the one-to-one -one work is there any other way i can work with you wouldn't it be amazing if you had a color therapy program or course or package online that people could download instantly whether that was a series of six meditations on six different colors um, or if that person was struggling with abundance you know bringing in more money and income that you could work with the color of green and black and red and create some sort of a package in gold and uh, create a, an abundance package for that person and you say okay look get straight you, you can you can get this it's uh, instead of you booking three sessions for 400 euro or, or whatever the price would be and um, you can get this package this online package and get instant lifetime access for 97. so it's the way you present the offer as well so that's all in, in the abundant heart program if anyone is interested in that just pm me and um i'll give you access to that but um, Lorraine, how's that resounding with you? How is that helping you? And if anyone else has any questions around that, I would love. Okay, can you talk about limiting beliefs about business growth, specifically related to fees? Oh God, I love that. So that's Sonny. Sonny, am I saying your name right? Please help me out here. Or is it Sonny Marie? Or is it Sam Marie? Maria? Please uh, help me out here. I know you're in my community a long time, so it's very nice to see you live here. Hi, Catherine, and hi, Jeannie. Hi, Emery. So, um, was there just one thing? Was there anything else that I wanted to say to um, Lorraine? So, so I have one client. I'll just give you an example. And um, this client was already working in personal development one-to-one -one in groups with, with people and she had some clients coaching clients and um, but she was delivering these classes all over she had a very young baby was literally really running herself ragged so we created a whole strategy and program uh, for her she instead of the the days or the events that she was running we created a whole new beautiful event she got really clear on her avatar really clear on her ideal client or sacredly contracted client got really clear on the transformation that she was could uniquely provide with all of the tools and, and the skills that she had and um created something specifically for that client like a dream retreat uh, wellness for women package and so she created the sales page she used the systems she got really good at uh, like there was a while there that she couldn't she didn't have paypal set up so she couldn't accept payment so there was all that's to and fro and um, there was a belief came up around this might sort of answer your question uh, sani but i'm coming to it there was a belief that came up around maybe too many people will book and i won't be able to handle it and i was like look that's really too many people book you can you can rearrange you can arrange another date and fill up that event as well so she ran has uh, planned uh, three events and she has completely sold out two of them random so this is all just just happened for her in the last uh, three months and she's just and um, now filling her third event and uh, this is giving her freedom it's giving her more time with her family it's giving her consistent income people are paying her in advance she can't believe that people are actually paying her in advance and the breakthroughs that people are having even before they get there and now she's working on creating a package or service that she can uh, offer those women that come and have this huge transformation on the day that they can step into that might be online it might be a group it might be a service so um how is that, Lorraine? How do they answer your question? 
I hope that that was useful. Uh, my suggestion for anyone that is still just doing one-to-one -one, um, uh, one -one sessions with clients and you're looking to expand and you're looking to grow but you don't quite know how is to consider getting into a, a coaching program or package or community. I have one. The Abundant Heart program is a fantastic starting point for just your, getting your first package and using all these technologies and just really getting it online. Or another step for that would be full business support in the Wealthy Light Workers program. That would be opening the 1st of November. If anyone is interested in it, just PM me and we can talk about it. But I would suggest that whether it's my community or another, but that you get into a community of uh, light workers that can support you right where you are now in your business. Because without that support, it's very difficult to keep going. When you're in a community, you have people that are, uh, aren't as far ahead as you. Maybe they haven't even got their first clients. But then you also have people that are using all these online technologies and strategies and marketing and mindset and all of this and they're they're creating consistent income in their business like some of my mastery mentatron clients um now this week are just their clients are just finding them out of the ethers they're just arriving at the door and, and they're getting booked and double booked and you know so um it really is the big the first step on any of this new journey if you're stepping into online is to get connected in the community and the coach and the program and just start taking the step by step from someone that has already done what you need and um, to do another thing i would say just to you might have heard this word leverage leverage your time and it's about using like it's like instead of one hour per client what could you do with that one hour if you were working with a group of maybe six people or ten people so that could be um, physical groups or it could also be online groups where you have meeting rooms people told me for years that i couldn't do uh, holistic work and practitioner work online but i absolutely can color therapy you can do online reiki you can do online um an lp practitioner i do it online uh, spiritual business coaching online, everything you can do online. So it's just a matter of, you know, getting into a community, opening and allowing your mind to expand a little bit around the possibilities. So I hope this is useful. Um, I'm a little bit scattered today because it's my first time. So I know as I go on, I will get a little bit more um, concise and into more detail and get more specific about what I, what I want to share with you each day. But I'm just going to quickly answer san maria's question so it's can you talk about limiting beliefs about business growth and specifically relate to fees so you might be and this is for everybody out there when i was teaching when i had one-to-one -one clients say i had one-to-one -one clients somebody came to me for an angel card reading it was 45 euros so this is maybe five years ago it was 45 euros now for someone to come to have a one-to-one -one session with me it's 497 500 euros for someone to come and have a one-to-one -one session with me a one-off session and I, I rarely offer one-off sessions i usually offer a package because that's the sort of growth that i love i love to spend time i love to see clients grow and change and evolve and really get results over time but there was a time when i was charging 45 euros and that's all i was charging that's all i was getting i wasn't getting paid up front and um, i wasn't getting paid in advance people were cancelling um, and i know that a lot of you watching this today are, are could be in the same situation so the one single thing that i changed is i stopped selling my tools and i started selling the transformation that i provide this is the absolute key this is the key this is the key and if you can get this in your spiritual business and um, everything will change i teach this in the abundant heart there are two modules around this whole process but it's about instead of selling a uh, reiki session angel card reading a color therapy session um 
instead of selling all of these things, these tools, an LP practitioner, you sell the uh, transformation. So you sell um, healing trauma, healing trauma through physical movement. So you sell either a one-to-one -one session or a package. I sell uh, spiritual business coaching, which is a combination of NLP, backflow remedies, angel card reading, um, Reiki, everything that I do, everything that I've learned, and business, um, traditional skills, and mindset tips, and, and marketing. All of that comes together. So I'm not selling any one of those tools or techniques. I'm selling the transformation. So when you get clear, and you just might need some help on this, but when you get really clear, crystal clear on what the transformation is that you provide, everything becomes easier. It is like turning on the light for your, there are people out there that you're sacredly contracted to, to work with, to offer your healing gifts to. And at the moment they cannot see you because you're just selling Reiki or healing, or you're not selling anything, you're selling everything to everybody. And but when you get clear on the on the person that you're here to serve, and, and there's a whole process around this, but it's about getting and it's to do with your journey, your healer's journey that you've gone through in your life, and the challenges and the skills that you've learned that make you unique. When you get clear on um who you're here to serve and what the transformation is that you provide for them. Every single live stream that you do, every single email that you write, every single Facebook post that you do becomes a light bulb, becomes a call to action. You stand out like a lighthouse for your people, for your people that you're sacredly contracted to serve. And literally, energetically, it looks like a light being switched on this lighthouse and just shining out and suddenly where people were crashing in around the rocks can suddenly see you and they're being guided into your programs and packages. And these are the clients that you absolutely love. They don't drain you. You absolutely, you come out energized. They come out energized. They do everything that you say. They're just dream clients. Whereas I would guess that if you're just throwing out your Reiki and your tools to everybody and people are grabbing them and they're not really suited to them, that what happens is you end up trying and trying and trying and trying lots of things with, with a person that comes for a session. They leave, haven't probably gone over time, not really um, getting the full results that they could have. And you end up feeling exhausted. When they leave, you feel exhausted. All you want to do is get into bed. Um, and you also feel there's a, there's a bit of a failure piece comes in there, a bit of guilt piece comes in there because you're just thinking, I didn't serve, I didn't do enough. That and not enoughness comes in. And really and truly, what that means is that you're just serving the wrong person. You're just serving clients that are somebody else's clients. Your clients are out there. There is no such thing as competition. Your clients are out there, or there's no need for competition in the spiritual world. Your clients are there. You, before you came here, you filled out your sacred contract with your guardian angel and your archangels, and you said, right, this is what I want to do, this is who I want to serve, and they gave you the and the names, and they gave you the dates and times and everything, and all you need to do is show up uniquely as you, a bright shining light out there in the universe, and your clients will find you. You are like a magnet, you are like a bright shining light they're like oh my god I've been looking for you all my life here 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 I am and they'll pay you because they see the value of the work and they will take action and they won't drain you so there is a whole piece uh Sane Maria around charging and there is an upgrade and a vibrational upgrade experience that you go through and I talk about this in the abundant heart mainly with clients because this is where we talk about money in the divine pricing module but it's about um starting where you are so <clears throat> if at the moment you're charging maybe 45 let's just take that as an example say 50 just to round it off so if you're charging 50 at the moment and you haven't put your prices up for a year or two years the fastest way to bring in new clients and to raise your prices is to raise your prices <clears throat> 
and then offer a discount. So what you can do is you can say to your list, um, thank you for being a loyal and beautiful customer, client of mine over the last how many years? Just want to let you know that all prices, my prices will be going up on the first of whatever the month is, let's say it's November, so say November. I just want to give you this opportunity to get, book a package of sessions half price before that date for you as a valued member of my community. My clients have used this simple strategy and have like one client signed up for the abundant heart, um, that's a thousand euro right now, and um, he, to just did this one simple strategy. He raised his prices, gave a discount um, to a current uh, community, and literally made his investment back on the program just with that one tip. So if you could even take that tip and implement it stay in the business, um, it would make a huge difference. So let me see. And just to say that if anyone hasn't got yet the fast cash for light workers a lot of people that come um, onto my programs or you know come into my community and they want to work with me and they're doing all the free stuff and they want to take that next step and, and really take their business a little bit further you know take it seriously as a business start expanding your reach getting out there online um Sometimes you just can't afford to invest right now where you are. So I've created a, a masterclass of tips. I got up one morning, Archangel Michael there a few months ago, literally, I, I woke up on a mission, did a, a video recording with, you know, just literally off the cuff and recorded uh, 13 different tips and techniques that you can use to get your business. And so that includes getting clear on, on your actual transformation, being able to verbalize that to clients. Um, there's a piece in there about networking, there's a piece in how to raise your prices, there's a piece in how to create packages if you're only doing one-to-one. -one. There's, I don't know, there's loads and loads of tips in there that will help anybody, especially if you're trying to raise the money to come and work with me or work with a coach or just get into a program to really make your business sing. So I'm just going to check through the comments and make sure there isn't anything else um, okay, so Sani said, that's perfect, that's great, I'm glad I answered that. Is there anything else on that? Just type it in and let me know. Um, so Lorraine, yeah, that sounds good. I have ideas to do an online package. So it's probably more about me stepping out of my comfort zone and putting myself out there. Absolutely, my love. And if you keep watching, I have video, I'm going to be doing these live streams every single day at 1 o'clock this week. So if you can pop back in or watch the replay, or as more questions, you know, let the questions percolate now over the next few days, post them, and I will answer them around that, you know, what does it take to just step outside your comfort zone? The goodies are outside your comfort zone, and it's just about taking that leap of faith. However, I'm a great advocate of, you know, doing your due diligence, making sure that you have support so that you can take that leap and you know, really understanding what the leap is. And I, you know, any money that you pay for courses or programs, it's an investment. It has to bring money back at, at some stage. It has to bring money back. So, you know, if you apply, a lot of people, some people invest in my programs and they don't take the steps and then the investment doesn't work. But if you invest in a program and you follow it step by step by step by step, um you will get you you'll get your money back but you've just got to follow the steps and you know that being that being said sometimes life gets in the way and um you know but but there is so that's it you're selling the transformation so i hope i really hope this is useful hi ashton hi karen hi francis lovely to see us hi rose hi jenny so I can't see any more questions, so unless there are more questions, I'm going to pop off. I'm going to leave this at a nice 35 minutes for our first one. But I'll be back on here tomorrow at 1 o'clock and every single day for the rest of this week, Monday to Friday at 1 o'clock, answering your questions. I have so many questions. I have so many questions. I'm going to leave you for some of them. 
So how to follow your intuition in your spiritual business and make money while sharing your healing gifts. Uh, how your mindset affects your spiritual business bottom line and how to use it for great results. That's something, I will go more into that, Sane. That's something like um, what we covered today. Uh, how asking for help and receiving it is the only way to make your spiritual business a success. How do I build an online community of raising, raising fans? I have literally hundreds of questions here. Um, I don't have money to invest right now, help. Uh, my, my, oh, I love this one. Oh, my clients won't pay for that. It's just not true. We're going to do a whole live stream around um, money and pricing. And I'm actually going to put the link um, in this for my divine pricing workshop, which is only um, it's part of the seven step program. So I'm going, I'm going to post that today. So you'll get that. You can, it's, it's about an hour and it's all around um, how to price. And the different mindset stuff that comes up it's a brilliant video so i'm going to post that in there but i will post in the link and um, you can go to ashling mooney forward slash cash and you'll get that master class of tips that will help you in your business and uh, please share this uh, video if you, if you feel it was useful and you feel it might be useful for some other light workers out there that um would need this today or need the information or need this just this bit of extra support so this training, this video series that I'm doing is going to be part of a training and it's going to help me to develop a brand new training in, um, in just a few weeks that I'll be posting out there. So if you're not on my email list, please get on it right away so that you'll have forced access to that free training when it's available. And everybody who has who knows me in the last few years knows that I give and give and give. So what, if you just participate in this free training, you can come on in leaps and bounds and then if you choose to you can step into one of the programs so all my love i hope this was useful and i will see you again tomorrow at one o'clock so bye for now